Welcome back to the Connect Network TV on the CW. I'm your host, Stitches, with my fabulous co-host, Ms. Wendy. But Wendy, I am super excited because today we are talking with, she has a, a repertoire of added, added things to, to her name. Uh, but we're speaking with healthcare entrepreneur, licensed nurse practitioner, doctor of nursing practice, business and life coach. She's a mom and own, the owner of Nurse Practice. Newer LLC. Please help me welcome to the show, Miss Lauren DeRoy to the set. Hi, Lauren. Hello, ladies. Thank you for having me. Such a such a huge honor. Well, thank you. the pleasure is ours. Yes, we love that you're here with us today. So please tell us, after years of being a nurse, at what point in your career did you decide to become an entrepreneur and why? Yeah, so the moment that I think it kind of really hit me that I needed to tweak my path a little bit. And I was driving my little swanky Cadillac coupe and I had my ICU job and I was like really feeling like I just, I was becoming, you know, I just like, I was excited about everything. And not that I, I wasn't, not to, that I did become not proud of what I was doing, but I was listening to somebody you've probably heard of as Robert Kiyosaki. And he was talking about how even physicians, when you're trading your time for money, you're always tied to that and you don't have freedom. And it hit me like a ton of bricks that I was tied to all of these school loans and that I was going to have to wear what we call the golden handcuffs, where even though we may have a higher salary after graduating and going through all that schooling, you're kind of stuck because you can't get another job that's going to pay off those school loans. And a lot of us come to really know and feel and understand what those golden handcuffs are. And so that was the moment that I thought, I need to figure out how people are doing this this passive thing where people are, are earning an income passively. Love that. Thank you for sharing that. And so interesting, you already have helped hundreds of medical professionals uh, to actually be freed from the hustle and this the chains yeah. that, that we're talking about, what do you define as the hustle? I define the hustle as running from door to door, chart to chart, not being able to put your life in the order that I believe it, it should be, or not the order that I believe, but the order that you believe. For me, I knew that the things that made the most impact on my life, and that was for me, that was God. And for me, that was family. I was working 40 to 60 hours a week. Mm -hmm. And that's when, you know, I had a I had a moment in my life that I said no more. And I, I thought back to that, that passive income. I thought this is, you know, it's a little bit longer of a story than, than just that instantly happening. But I knew that that was the key. And I had to hone back in on that on that thought. So good. So good. And so let's get into it. Functional medication is your thing. And it is National Nutrition Month. So how is that different from medication, like the holistic approach? Majority of what functional medicine is, is that we're looking at the root cause. So instead of, instead of prescribing a medication that will suppress symptoms, a really great example of this that, that most people can, can easily wrap their mind around is eczema. Well, in conventional medicine, we will, you know, if, if they fail kind of more conservative treatments, the first prescription medication that someone would come to me for as a, as a practitioner would be a steroid, a topical steroid. Or what we do in functional medicine that was look for that root cause. We might look for, in, in conventional medicine, we might look for food or skin irritants. The, in functional world, I might look at your gut health. What's actually going on is that that rash on somebody's skin is actually a fire alarm saying, hey, there's something wrong. I want to get down to the root cause and find why is that inflammation there? People are mind blown when they come to me for, you know, they want, they want to treat their gut health. I'm treating the root cause of your symptoms, not just the symptoms themselves. Did that, did that kind of... I sure do wish I would have met you when I was a kid because <laughs> you would have saved my parents thousands and thousands of dollars. Mm -hmm. Honey. Yes. yes. But I love that you get to the root of things. And mm -hmm. the, that you mentioned, it tells everything. So tell us what products and services do you um, actually provide at Nurse Prackpreneur? Did I say that right? Yes, you did. Yes. I know it's a little bit of a tongue twister. So you did awesome. And nurse practpreneurs. So the, the offers that we have here right now is we teach you one, we have a 48 hour CEU course that is certified. We're working on getting our second board certification. So 
If you are in healthcare, you get the FIMP recognition, Functional Integrative Medical Practitioner. And then we also have, have uh, courses that help you scale and grow your business. Like don't stop at just that degree. Like how is that gonna leverage you in your future further? I always say, you know, especially in the healthcare field, your medical mind is a gold mind. So you can be helping people in, in more ways. And I teach people how to do that, how to put their courses on passive evergreen systems and the things that they're passionate about and how they can help patients that way. We have an, a community in, in addition to the, to the courses that we teach about business and about functional medicine. So now that you bring up business, let's talk money. How can uh, medical professionals do less but make more? And what are some streams of passive income for healthcare professionals? What I always say as is one of the most important things that you can scale passively and that you can bring in that passive income is your own course or creation you can do collaborations with others and if you don't want to have your own course but that's really one of the best ways the information market is just absolutely booming what i help my practitioners with who are in in the healthcare field how they can build up that passive income is your medical mind is a gold mind so you can put that into courses and then attach that to uh, what we call, this is a little bit techy, but not too bad, SEO. So it's search engine optimization. That's what, that's my favorite thing to teach because that's, um, that's my favorite way. Yeah. We were talking earlier about the college grads who are unemployed. Mm -hmm. How can recent grads or someone in that position uh, turn their passion into their dream life, really? Yes. There's, there's so many different ways. So really like, you know, my, because that's my background, I love working with other practitioners, other healthcare, really that's, it's not limited to, to just the medical field. Anybody who might be in that scenario where they, they have this education, but they don't know that they can't get a job. You can turn that into your own information business. You can utilize that in a way to, you know, help somebody else. You don't even have to have a big audience right off. You can, you know, help other individuals who do have an audience build that. And you can turn that knowledge still into an evergreen system. And you can use that information to help other people. You know, one of my mentors told me once that if you never stop solving problems, you'll never go broke. I love it. You, I love the gems that you're dropping in. And those are some really yeah. great tips. And um, before you go, can you tell us a little bit more about your certification program? I'd love to hear more on that. Yeah. So it's 48 hours and they go through the course and they sit a board at the end and it's an 80 hour board. Uh, we are certified through the HNCC and you get those 48 hours. The 48 hours are specifically for nurses or practitioners but we are uh, open to to really anybody really anybody that has a passion a lot of health coaches also you can really up level your game and how you're helping your individuals and how you can be like i was saying proprietary that's what's really awesome about functional medicine right now is that there's just enough awareness to it that people are like okay it's legit our course is comprehensive so we go over we go over gut health anxiety depression uh, neurologic uh ailments we have cardiovascular we have we go over every system but the real truth of the matter is that because it's so comprehensive we don't look at the body as broken up into systems that we have to kind of go over everything but you can niche it down you can you can take that one part that you just love um, anxiety and oppression is another one because we do it so wrong in conventional medicine and it just it breaks my heart because people feel convicted and they feel guilty and shamed because they're like, this medication's not working for me or the things that I'm doing with cognitive behavioral therapy or you know, psychiatry, right. it isn't helping me. And they feel shamed when it's because we're not focusing on your issue, which is so often the gut. Um, but you can go into- <laughs> We can go into a whole lot. <laughs> yes, we can. I'm sorry, we really can. But yeah, it no, is very really comprehensive. Yeah, no, but it's, it's good. You could tell that, talk about education. You can tell you're, you're truly knowledgeable in this field and, and you have so much heart and care for it and compassion for people. So it mm -hmm. sounds like the sky is the limit. So I wanna ask uh, what is next for Nurse Practpreneur and how can our audience connect with you, Lauren? Yes, absolutely. Well, the next thing that we're doing, anybody can be a part of this. Uh, if you go to passiveclients.com, I'm teaching and kind of like pulling back the curtains and revealing a lot of things that I wish I knew right off the bat. 
in a five day course. And we're just going to be, I'm going to be live. People can talk to me. They can, you know, ask any questions they would like. We'll have a teaching session and then we'll also have a Q&A session. So it's going to be something that anybody can join. It's 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 really low threshold for anyone to be a part of it. And um, that's kind of really the next thing that, that we're doing. If anyone wants to to be a part of that or learn more, I'm, I'm always an open book and I love just helping individuals. Well, I know I learned so much today and I can't thank you enough for your time, Lauren. And don't go anywhere, Connect family. Stay with us because when we come back, we will be joined by the lovely London Knighton with the tea we've all been waiting for. So stay tuned. You're watching the Connect Network TV on The CW.